What's up my loves? Welcome back to my channel. My name is Maya. If this is your very first time here. So today y'all we're about to just do a quick little get ready with me for a dinner date. It's actually Sunday and <laughs> yesterday I just had a rough day. Just frustrated and just you know feeling a little overwhelmed so I wanted to just go out and go on a dinner date before you even ask. No it ain't with no dude. <laughs> Cause y'all know I ain't dating right now. But I just wanted to do something to make myself feel more like myself because I'm just coming from a very frustrated 24 hours. So we're pretty much just gonna take this look, which is daytime, I've had it on all day. And we're gonna take it from day to night and then just get ready for a little dinner date and just chill out today, honestly, y'all. Cause your girl is just trying to <laughs> woosa for a second. <laughs> <laughs> Today's video is made in partnership with Bath & Fun, so thank you to them for sponsoring us today. And we're gonna hop right into the video. All right, y'all, so like I said, um, I haven't had this makeup on too, too long <laughs> today, but <laughs> it is just my normal, like, everyday makeup. Y'all have seen me do it a million times, which is why I was like, but this video, let's just kind of do something different and take our daytime normal makeup into night since we're going out on a dinner date um i had a whole like topic and stuff ready for this video but honestly like i said i'm just i've just kind of been a little frustrated and overwhelmed and i just didn't feel like thinking <laughs> and i feel like i should be allowed that <laughs> <laughs> so I was like, I just want to do a get ready with me that's just more on the chill side and let's just, if we talk about something, we talk about something. If we don't, then we don't. Let's just, you know, prioritize ourselves and go to dinner. <laughs> but anyway, the first thing that I would do when I'm taking my makeup from day to night is the eyes. First of all, we're going to take the lashes off because um, I don't really ever like to do my eyeshadow with my lashes on. It gets all on there, then I got to go over the lashes with liner and ain't nobody got time for that. So, I usually always go into bronzer on my eyes, which is what I have right now. But I'm just going to do a little bit of an eyeshadow look over this to kind of just, you know, spruce up the look and bring it good for night. I am gonna go first into just a deeper like brown shade and I'm gonna work this into the creases. Like I don't want the eye to be super duper harsh but I do wanna bring a little bit of drama into the look for nighttime. Gonna add this brown eyeshadow and kinda like follow my crease like that. Like where my eyebrow, eyebrow. <laughs> where my eyebrow creases and just kinda buff it out a little bit. Yeah, I was gonna ask one of my girlfriends to meet me for dinner tonight, but I was like, you know, I might as well just go ahead and go by myself because I'm so used to doing that anyway. I didn't want this to be like another solo day vlog. And also because I didn't necessarily feel like, you know, having a whole full conversation, I love to like talk about self-love type of ideas when I'm doing solo day vlogs. And today I just don't, who I just don't have it in me. I ain't got it in me. Okay, I just gotta be honest. I ain't got it in me today. <laughs> but yeah, we're actually going out to brunch tomorrow or lunch tomorrow. So I was like, you know, I'm cool just going by myself tonight. Per usual, I have been loving my own company anyway. So <laughs> we might as well. Taking a cleaner brush and going around this just to kind of buff it out on the sides. And then one more step y'all to bring this to nighttime is I'm gonna add a shimmer right on top i always love a good gold so i think that's what i'm gonna do something that really just pops and oh yes mm. something that really just pops and just kind of turns this into a nighttime vibe so that color wasn't giving me enough so i went ahead and wet the brush meaning i just kind of like um sprayed it with some setting spray and it's giving me much more of like a pigmented vibe I'm kind of really doing a lot of detail work up in here a little bit. <laughs> Just kind of getting close to my mirror because I kind of want this color to like kind of go upwards. Look at me back in tutorial mode. Who is she? <laughs> because I've been missing my makeup tutorials. This kind of needs to be blended out. So I'm taking a brown shade a little bit lighter than the other one that I use in the corner and just kind of going around. And that brush is way too big. Maya, stop being lazy. <laughs> so I get lazy and mess up my whole face, child. Cause I feel like a good wing gives, you know, nighttime vibes and a good way to just bring your daytime makeup and make it more, you know, vibey. 
I personally feel like I can't really accomplish anything in life and be super successful if I am not essentially, you know, taking care of myself and able to truly like do Maya. And the only way that I'm able to do that is making sure that I'm okay. Like I got to be okay to be able to live my life. So nights like these for me is like super, super important. Especially with me just being single and not necessarily having a significant other. I don't know why I said not necessarily. Obviously, I just don't. <laughs> just not having a significant other to do special things for me and to make me feel special. It is definitely, for me, my responsibility to do that for myself and to really give that effort towards making sure I'm okay. Just trying to allow myself to breathe for a second. I feel like we definitely should give ourselves permission to do that. And I feel like y'all can kind of pick up on my mood. Like, I'm good, but I'm just like kind of still just in a weird, just in a weird way. <laughs> but you know, that's not gonna stop the show. We gonna keep it pushing, keep it moving. But you know, that's why we're doing this, to just kinda whew, change up the vibes. You hear me? So some other products we can use to spruce up the face and bring us from day to night are from Fenty Beauty. <laughs> so I have worked with FabFitFun before on my channel, but FabFitFun is a subscription box and they offer quarterly boxes full of all types of goodies, okay? So we talking body care, um, home decor, beauty, fashion, just all types of different things that you can get in your quarterly box. So that fit funds boxes are like super, super valuable. So meaning you will get a whole bunch of stuff for way less than how much all that stuff would cost separately <laughs> for just that one box. And their next box for spring will include some Fenty Beauty products. Like I said, they do curate these boxes for, um, you know, different people with different lifestyles, fashion, beauty, all of that. And with them including Fenty Beauty products in their next box, I feel like they're aware that, you know, there's some variety out there and that people have different styles, different beauty preferences, and Fenty Beauty is all about that. So to further take a look from day to night, I'm gonna be using the Kilowatt Freestyle Highlighter Duo. And in this duo, I'm gonna be using Girl Next Door. And I did already have on a highlighter, however, it wasn't nearly as popping as this one is. <laughs> I want to look kind of extra tonight, so I'm happy that this highlighter is an option to be in the Fat Fit Fun Spring box because this one is super duper popping. And I do own one of these. This is not the one that I have. I think I have the one that has more money in it. And when I tell you it gives the shine, sis, it gives the shine. And I absolutely love Fenty Beauty's highlighters. I'm gonna go ahead and work some of this onto my cheek because I actually did not have highlighter on my cheeks at all today. I kind of just went matte for the cheeks. And I love how this one kind of has like a pinky tone to it. It's kind of hard to see on camera, but in person you can really see that pinky tone. And y'all know when I like to apply my highlighter, I like for it to just look you know, highlighted on the cheek and not just a little line right there at the top of the chop of the cheekbones. That's not cute. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I try to really blend it out and I just grabbed a bigger brush so that I kind of can hit more surface area and it kind of is tapered off on the edges. Also, you know, it is a dinner date, so we might as well hit our brow bone with a little bit of some highlighter as well. I don't do this that often anymore. If you notice when I do my makeup, most of the time I skip this unless I'm feeling real special. And tonight is one of those nights because I just, I just want to look really, really pretty sitting in a restaurant, eating my dinner alone. <laughs> So another Fenty Beauty product that will be in the spring Fat Fit Fun box is the Gloss Bomb Heat. So I have it in two shades here. I have it in Hot Cherry and Lemon Lava. Hot Cherry is just kind of like a reddish tone. And then Lemon Lava is more of a gold tone gloss. And because it's nighttime, I'm gonna add a little bit of some liner so that my gloss can give, you know, nighttime vibes. And then we're gonna go into Lemon Lava. But I feel like with the eyes, it would go perfectly. And when you're like super close up, which I'm gonna zoom in so y'all can see, it kind of like plays off of the eyes. The lips are giving me like 90s baddie vibes. <laughs> <laughs> it's cute. And that is the look y'all from day to night. I feel like just adding those three things, which is eyeshadow, a little bit of a brighter highlight and a different lip can really bring your daytime look to 
a nighttime look. So I am gonna use one other Fenty Beauty product while we are getting dressed, which is the Diamond Bomb All Over Diamond Fail, and this is in Royal Icing. But I don't want you guys to miss out on getting some of Fenty Beauty products, so make sure that you guys sign up for a Fat Fit Fun membership at fatfitfun.com as soon as possible so that you do have a chance to get some Fenty Beauty in the spring box while supplies do last, child. So here we go. <laughs> <laughs> all right y'all so i'm gonna go ahead and spray my face and then we're gonna go ahead and get dressed all right y'all so i really want to look a little fancy tonight and i'm actually just really really glad that i'm doing this tonight thursday through sunday i'm taking off so i won't be vlogging or doing anything like that those days but i'm happy i'm doing this because these first few days of the week i am very overloaded and i just kind of want to get ahead of it get my mind right spend some time with myself because you know amir's birthday is on tuesday too and it's just a lot coming at me <laughs> work wise as well so we're about to just go kick it for a little bit and hopefully hopefully you guys can feel the vibes as well i do have this white dress from lulu's that i think i want to wear tonight and i was thinking about wearing it with my black boots and with a black bag you know and just do like a white dress with all black everywhere else you know i feel like that's gonna be real chic so i'm gonna go ahead and throw <laughs> this dress on and with this dress having this cutout down here and me not being the smallest busted woman <laughs> <laughs> I gotta make sure I'm a little tucked in on the side so that I'm, um, you know, so that we keep it cute and classy per use. So another option to go in the Fat Fit Fun box is the Diamond Bomb. And we're gonna put that all over. However, we gotta make sure we ain't ashy first. So I'm about to just put on some body cream real quick just to preface our Diamond Bomb. Then I'm gonna take a little bit of the Diamond Bomb and y'all, I think I'm gonna put it a little bit like just on my chest a little bit just to kind of give us some you know a little shimmer <laughs> all over the body and I don't want to do too too much I just want to do just enough just to make me feel cute and sexy for the night you guys know that I'm the queen of wanting to keep my jewelry simple so I think I am just going to keep on the uh, earrings that I have on right now and then I'm throwing on this just gold watch and this one is actually vintage this used to be my grandmother's i'm not sure what the brand is but i've had it for a long time and i'm always going to keep her <laughs> and then i am going to be wearing very good girl tonight which you guys know is from carolina ferrera when i first got this in i said that i feel like it was just perfect for just daytime but i feel like it's good for night too i feel so sexy and cute in this so cute like i said before i am gonna be wearing boots because it's cold outside so i'm gonna be wearing these black sock boots today and i think we're gonna go ahead and do the bottega bag as a clutch today i went ahead and tucked in the straps on inside the bag so that they're nicely tucked and it acts as a clutch tonight so so my taser is already in here because you know it's nighttime and whenever i'm going on night i need my taser <laughs> obviously i'm taking my gloss bomb heat which is what i'm wearing tonight i need a mirror just in case you know make sure i'm gucci um <laughs> some lotion to make sure i'm not ashy my wallet of course and then i'm leaving some space for my keys next i'm gonna go ahead and pop on my shoes y'all and then we're gonna be ready to go all right y'all so before we put on our coats this is the outfit this is the dress and the clutch as well as the boots and it's giving i'm feeling it and i'm hungry and i'm excited to go out to a dinner tonight let's pick out a coat so I decided to go for my long pea coat, which I know is from Tommy Hilfiger. I showed it to you guys in the last vlog, but I think this is what I'm going to go for. I think it's super cute. And at the bottom, it hits like right where the dress ends. So I felt like that was a cute little vibe. So yeah, y'all, you see how kind of like you can see where the dress ends and where the coat ends? I feel like that's a vibe and it's giving. All right, y'all, so this is the vibe and we're gonna go ahead and head out to dinner we're ready to go <laughs> so y'all in this video i pretty much just wanted to go out to dinner and treat myself and i feel like we definitely need to normalize making sure that we're doing something for ourselves when we feel overwhelmed whether that for you is a nap child <laughs> a nap or you know just doing something nice for yourself or even just locking yourself in your room away from everyone else in your household just to pull yourself together and i just feel like that's so important because I push all the time that we can't pour from an empty cup. And today, during the day, y'all, I was just feeling very, very empty. Like super empty, super just deflated and defeated and 
just needing encouragement. Of course, I went to church this morning and that helped me. I got in my word today and that helped me, but I just felt like I needed to do something for myself tonight. Um, it wasn't in my plan. This is not what I saw myself doing tonight, <laughs> but in order for me to get through the next few days, I just needed to pull myself together, look cute for myself, enjoy my night. I just needed a breather and I just wanted to take you guys along with me and I would hope that you guys would you know figure out what is it for you that will be your go-to self-care thing that you just do for you when you just need to woosa forget life forget all the things you're going through all the responsibilities child sometimes you just gotta just really in and really focus on yourself so that you can show up for your loved ones your job your family your goals your dreams everything you can't show up for all of that if you ain't good so this is me getting good <laughs> <laughs> and I'm also just so happy that I allowed myself to take a break from just what I would normally do. Typically this video would have been super, super thought out or, you know, I write everything down. I'm super intentional about a topic and dot, dot, dot. And today I just, I'm just gonna be honest. I didn't have it in me, so <laughs> I didn't do it. Um, and I just, you know, was hoping and praying that you guys would still enjoy the video of just kind of being with me on this self-love moment um, this weekend while I reel myself in. I feel like it's also about giving yourself grace. So in that way, I was trying to be more graceful and not so hard on myself. I would just hope that you guys would figure out what this means for you. Cause y'all know I love to go out and get me some food, child, that I don't need. <laughs> <laughs> but that is my self-love love language <laughs> or self-love language let's let's say that we might have to coin that one <laughs> thank you guys so much for watching this get ready with me and little mini vlog i guess <laughs> and i'll see you guys in the next video bye